first graders, let's do a little friction science experiment today. If you look in your brown bag, you have one of these. Yeah. Or maybe you have some at home. You could try this with yours at home. Um, so I have two surfaces here. I have a carpet. Do you think that has a lot of friction or a little bit of friction? If I run my hands on it, I can feel bumps. It's pretty, not very clean right now. So I think this has a lot of friction. Ooh, if I rub my hand like this too, I can feel my hand getting warm. Remember in the video, they talked about friction makes heat. Now this floor is really cold, but this floor is pretty slick. It's a little bit dirty, a little bit of friction on it, but it's pretty smooth. So let's take my car. I pulled out two cars because I didn't want you to have to watch me crawl across the carpet as much as you might love that. So let's try this. We're going to use this. I think this one has a lot of friction and I don't think my car is going to go very far because I've already watched the science video on friction. But this blue truck, I'm going to do it on this slick tile and I think it's going to go really far because there's not as much friction. All right, let's let's check it out. Oh, it did go a little bit. Let me see if I can, can right there. Can you see where it went? All right, let's try this next one. Ready? One, two, three. Whoa. It's still going. It's still going. It stopped. All right. So your science experiment today is to race your car in two different places. One with a lot of friction and one with not very much friction. Take a picture so I know what kind of surfaces you raced your car on and be sure to let us know which one went further. All right, little scientists get to work. <laughs>